You're listening to Ask Holly Hall. This is Holly Hall from AskHollyHall.com. Today we will be talking about anything from astrology, predictions, clairvoyancy. I am a master astrologer of a background education in philosophy and psychology, neurolinguistic programming, past life regression, and I'm also clairvoyant. Sit back and relax and enjoy the episode. Right now, things are sluggish. Energy is sluggish. Um, People are sort of taking their time, tired, needing a lot of sleep, feeling a bit um, nostalgic, looking at the past, reiterating the past in their minds, in their hearts. And also, they're finding that a lot of focus is around self-worth and money. And when we have this energy, not only is it not the best timing to expect a lot of action from yourself, from oneself, but it's also not a great time to expect a reaction or an instant cooperative collaboration with anybody else. So it's not the best time to pursue someone or a company or a situation in which you want um, a great, a fast, fast response and a fast action. And I'll give you, we're going to give the dates here of how long, how long that's going to last. And it's kind of off and on. All right. And then I'm, yeah, it's kind of off and on. So the first one is, it's pretty much been for the entire year and it's uh, going to continue until, until mid May, pretty much the beginning of May to mid May. There's still, we've still got Mars in Pisces until the 25th of May, but pretty much any time after mid May and especially after the 25th of May, is when you can create some collaboration with others. And that's that's what works best in the general uh, global prediction. And since, yeah, so, but then we've got this great energy in the third week of June. And so really, you know, after the 25th, or the yet and basically the last week, the last few days of of May, and especially June, that's when you want to fire up. We go back into that this. Energy. That's Everybody cool. is really engrossed in their own personal issues and their own personal problems again. In the world, sort of feeling sorry for themselves again. In yeah, we're looking at the end of October of 2022 and all of November, all of most of December. So right around Christmas, everyone's going to pick up speed again and everyone's going to be ready to move forward. They're done with the suppression, the feeling of sadness, loss, remorse, feeling victimized, etc. And they're going to get that energy back again.